Hey everyone, it's Mr. Everything and I have a bit of a different product today. Um, I've been working on, I actually bought this Forever Comfy, you know, what a femme name, but uh, I guess with me liking my home decor and my car cleaning products, I guess maybe I have become a little domestic. But I was given this uh, free chair, so I figured I would clear off my desk and set a, my laptop there and do some things. And so that's why I haven't been doing a lot lately. I've been occupied with that, but this chair is a little uncomfortable, so I bought this. And I was just going to do a quick unboxing, which isn't much of an unboxing. Uh, let me just show you. Make sure that's in the frame there. So it has a soft fleece cover. Two layers of foam. I'll show you that when I take it out, and there's a gel in the middle. I actually got this for $15 at my local Walmart. Uh, you can check the reviews. Some of the reviews on the Walmart website, there's only four. They're all fantastic, like four to five stars. And then I have... Uh, you check on Amazon the reviews are like there's a slew of one star reviews where they say it flattens out of the gel leaks so for $15 I thought you know it's better than 20 it's a risk but I was actually looking for it and couldn't find it I'm sure not to eat that um, so I, I was looking in a few sections I couldn't find it but I stopped and looked in the uh, just the regular cushions section and you can get just like a leather just cushion for ten dollars but it seemed a little too thin so I didn't know if it would be worth it or you can just get a regular cloth one and those are options and I also found a better quality one for twenty five dollars for a car so if this wouldn't work and it's really way too high but it's hard to find something that's not that much unless you just get a regular flat cushion like I was mentioning but this is all really just for you know whatever you want to call it posterior coccyx uh, rear end, uh, gluteus maximus, butt, backside, or most notably the human ass, but regardless, I'll give this a shot, and I think some of the problem is just probably some of the people that sit in it, because there's a lot of one-star reviews, come on, this is America, and there's a lot of people with a big butt, or as the media, or, you know, with the trendy where it'd be just a fat ass, so here's mine, if I can give you a, if that's if that's in the frame there my proportions I'm just gonna go ahead and sit in this and yeah it definitely has see my like thin girly legs there it uh, yeah I actually thought it would be way too like wide but better give myself a little more room here to spin it actually comes perfectly along the dimensions of the chair slides a little bit but not too much so because there's no straps on this I guess you could put down some you know rubber uh, grip grippy mat stuff but it's not sliding too much on me you could definitely go for one of those uh, curved shaped ones with like a little cut out part that you can fart through although they do say it, I thought it was a fart filter but I guess it's for your tailbone to be free but then you have to sit in the perfect posture probably so it's because it's molded to your legs so I kind of like just a solid piece again I'm not that heavy I'm about 175 so I've heard it takes a, about a half hour of sitting in it for it to actually thin a little bit and get your impression but then people say that it doesn't retain it so then it'll just kind of flatten out I'm probably gonna have to cut these off even though I say it's illegal because I guess it would become that far of a police state that you can't do that but and lastly, let me just show you the material inside. There's a gel section in between these two, which you can't tear it open. I guess if you like pull it apart, you could, but I don't want to. If it does for some reason leak, which some have, but I don't think it will happen in my case, I'll definitely make another review if this becomes a problem, if it thins out, if it leaks out. If it thins, I mean, it depends how, you know, how white trash you want to get or how much money you want to save. If it thins out, you still have some cushion. It can't just go into nothing. You could stuff some shirts in here or something. But, you know, Walmart, they're pretty good on returns, 90 days. If I have any problems, I'll probably just take it back and try the $25 one. That's a little bit thinner and a little bit more dense. But I think this will do. If, you didn't, if I didn't mention the dimensions are 18 in length, I believe 14 in width, and then the, the depth, I'm not sure if that's on the box, but it's probably a good two and a half three inches hopefully it will compress a bit because that does kind of look tacky being that big but for as much as I might use this now because I'm kind of setting this up as my desk area for my computer 
it definitely feels okay. So, not so much an unboxing because <laughs> just take it out of the box and you're done. But this is called the Forever Comfy Combination Cushion. And I'll leave that with you. Any problems, I'll make another video, put it in the description or in the comments. And this is what I'm going to be, um, so I'm going to be sitting. I don't know how else you could word that. That'll be the way I'm experiencing life from now on. And uh, I think it's useful, you know, even if you're a gamer, you know, a lot of them, people, they like to sit at their computer and play their console on a screen or have their computer if they're PC gamers. So this is kind of useful for anyone, really. Put it in your car or anything. So hope that was worth something. A little bit of fun trying to unbox something different. So I hope you enjoyed that. Thanks for watching. You'll see me in the next one.